All right, welcome to the Witcher playthrough part three. All right, last time we defeated the Royal Griffin in White Orchard, and we will be heading back to Elf Guardian Commander to turn in our bounty. All right, turn in the head for our bounty. And then we're going to do a little bit more exploration around White Orchard, try and do some more of the uh, question marks, but leveling up before um, this bard's tale begins near White Orchard. Go ahead and put the stuff through the headset. Years, but now seem just a few steps ahead. Do a little more exploration of White Orchard. Try and do all the question marks. Get the stones of power and stuff like that. Try and make as many potions and stuff like that we can before we go on to the next area. Oh, we, uh, we left it up here. All right. Can't remember where we saved it. We are actually right next to this. Let's see. We're still level two, aren't we? It's level seven, five levels higher. We do have Spectre Oil. Hmm. We have Spectre Oil. Here, let's apply it. The one thing I really wish is you could, like, have put either oil on the wheel or you had a wheel for oils and stuff like that so you could quick apply them. I guess before, uh, I think before you, you never even... You could only you couldn't apply oils during combat, which I guess I kind of wish maybe um, you still couldn't because it makes sense. Like you have to apply the oils before combat. Place of power should draw from it. Let's see, is it only going to come out during nighttime, or is it going to come out during daytime? Yep, there it is. So what are we going to do? Cune? I think Cune. Oh. I hate that when they do that, you can't lock, like, you lose your lock. Alright, yeah, this is going to be easy. If they have a sword, I kind of wish spirits you could... Oh, I can have it. Wish you could, uh, counter their attacks. Where'd he go? weird. Hmm. Strange. Bloody hands everywhere? Guarded treasure. I guess in some areas it makes sense. Uh. Alright, that. Oh! I forgot Kuhn wasn't. Where'd he go this time? Did he go back outside?
Maybe you can only defeat it at night time? I never had this I never had the problem before, like I don't think so. I always think I defeated it. Better from Colgrim of the Viper School. Serpent and Silver Sword. To Ivar Evil Eye, a Master Witcher of the Viper School. That's a terrible name. Evil Eye. Yeah, nobody's gonna think you guys are bad. I have now find all the legendary I have now found all the legendary diagrams once belonging to our order. Certain complications have arisen, however. On the way back to our keep, I stopped to rest the night in a village in the Temerian borderlands. Lots of peasants decided to make me into their scapegoat and accuse me of kidnapping some beekeeper's brat. They took me into the local Lord Lean's castle for interrogation, during which they found confiscated one of the diagrams, but do not fear, I will get it back. They did not find the others. I've evoked marrying common law and demanded a trial by ordeal instead of submitting to the whims of this baronet. My crest was granted and tomorrow I'm to cleanse the baronet's family crypt of wraiths. I expect this will prove little trouble. Perhaps I will already have returned to our keep by the time you receive this letter. Light the furnaces, we have some forging to do. Sorry, Colgrim. Oh, it looks like uh, he got ambushed though. There's what Witcher killers that look like, apparently looks like it. Anything else in here? You know, craft that silver sword. It probably would have been good for the beast fight, but did all right. Where is so he's really. Place of power. So we got a monster nest up there. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's do the monster nest. Run, Roach. Yep. Yeehaw. Dude, the trophy. I love the trophies. I love having the, the monster heads hanging there. I wish people commented on them more. Do you just like imagine someone coming in, coming in, uh, riding with that? Uh, oops. All right, no monsters respond. I think in the base game before the DLC stuff, like Magic. in the original base game. Of power. Wait, 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 I shouldn't do, which one is this one? Which sign is this? This is Ard and I'll keep the Igni. Yeah, I have Igni, I'll keep Igni. Igni. Evil nest, ought to just destroy it. Run away! First time I blew up a nest, I blew myself up. Oh shoot! Yeah, I forgot. just because I play this game that it feels so much easier. I remember playing the first time on Death March difficulty. Being super difficult. Alright, we got another point available. Let's put that into damage. Oh, I forgot I switched those out. Always the fast attack. I don't. I think the heavy attack should do more damage. 
because it, it doesn't even do it doesn't even seem to do double the damage of your fast attack that or your fast attacks you just do less damage or it's like easier to enemies for easier for enemies to block your fast attack because like the base fast attack versus the base heavy attack if you look at them like yeah you don't you do you don't you you do about three-fifths of your heavy damage with your quick attack so if you just spam the quick attack you I think your DPS overall yeah you do you do a big chunk of damage if you get a heavy attack in so like if you can only get a hit in or something it's good to do a heavy attack I guess uh, but if you're if you're able to uh, just constantly hit them then overall you can get more DPS in with the quick attack maybe that's the way they want it they intended it to design was DPS quick attack and then certain enemies the heavy attack was more proficient when you can only get a an attack in I always keep wanting to hit the triangle to get off my horse. I don't know why. I don't know which game that's from. Oh, it's probably, uh... It's probably, um... Arc. Too much arc and riding dinos. Probably gonna play a little bit of arc tonight. Okay. Probably gonna play some Kenna Bridge of Spirits. I think I'm getting close to finishing that. I don't think I will finish it by- Ah! Damn it! Stop it! I'm trying to- Where's that wolf going? Are those different wolves? Those are different wolves. Oh my goodness, my dog is laying next to me and she is- She is super hot. She's like a furnace, dude. Her belly's like up against the against my leg. Right, yeah, getting that damage up was definitely the good good idea I'm doing. Uh ah. Give me some dog livers, dog livers, wolf livers, wolf, uh, um, dag nabbit. Not a single, ugh. I wanted, uh, furs, skins. Those are usually worth a decent amount of money. The liver, the, 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 the livers, the livers are worth pretty decent too. At least I know that like, I might be able to use the livers and some potions. Orange. Vials. Those are worthless. I don't end up breaking... Oh, so wolf hide, oil. I don't end up breaking... Scrawled note. Things are going better and better for us. We've pitched camp in the heart of the forest near the old mill and have already done quite nice for ourselves. Folks are poor, so they say, but squeeze them and something always pops out. A sack of rain here, a few crowns there. Not bad for easy work, certainly better than the army. At least we've got something to fill our bellies and the risk that we'll pay for this all with our lives. Well, it's still less than we were charging the nilfs at Nautilus' order. Dirty funds. Find the bandit's treasure using your witcher senses. Can I get it? Nope. Ooh, werewolf decoction. Where's my horses? Still a board.
There we go. We'll fight. Looking for money. Especially, I need to repair my stuffs. Come on. When I first was playing the game, I was not hitting enough up enough of the hidden treasures and stuff like that. Need to, where am I going here? Oops. Slow now. Whoa. I, uh, I used to always have money issues. I was like, how the heck do people get money in this game? Like, I keep selling all the weapons and stuff, and it's, like, not making that much. Hello, Jets. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> son of a gout. Yeah, who son of a bitch? Oh, I think you're dead. I love it when the archers shoot their own... Shoot their own guys, too. That's the best. Like, you give it to... Get the... Get their guys between them. Like, just... Hide behind an enemy. So the archers shooting right at their own guy. So great. I'll just take them out for you. Especially, like, a high-level guy. Because, like, especially, like, in the harder difficulties, those arrows do so much damage. Oh, this is great. Alcohol. I love, I love getting alcohol. Ooh, yeah, there we go. More bomb stuff. It's always good making more bombs. Da, 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 da. Ooh, more. Dude, I love me some honeycombs. Took me the longest time to figure out how to do this. I shot him with a. Oh, hello. Look at that, only 50 damage. That was a heavy attack. Look at that, a heavy attack. 49 damage. Well, BS. Oh, there's more guys? I thought I cleared them out. Oh, wow. A lot more guys. I didn't realize how, how this far this went up. Alright, let's take this archer. Archer out first. Oh, get over here. So, oh, that was an accident. Almost worked though. Use Axie. Axie makes it so he's go. Trying. There we go. Axie and strong attack. Always good combo. He had a rope ladder. Okay. Actually, rope ladders are good. They if you give it to sell it to the right person, those are like sixteen coin. And they all had rope. What were they, like, stealing? They must have, like... Oh my goodness, they did have a lot of good stuffs. I love all these bushels and baskets. They have one goat hide in them. Just one. It's a rusty stuff. Water. That's good. I was going to say, I'm out of Thunderbolt, so I might as well switch to food. Switch this to Swallow. Dirty funds. Collect your rewards from the Elf Guardians. Oh, that's the Beast of White Orchard. That was just the side quest. See what else is nearby. I'm getting heavy too. Anything else?
Hidden treasure right by hidden treasure. Oh no, it's a this one a quest one. Timber. Guess I could break that down for wood. Crafting. Spy note. Spy notes. Fifteenth day of observation, twenty third of Burke. Back in camp. Brought in heaps of plunder, mostly armor and weapons, but this time a sealed chest too. Towards dusk, a man delivered rations of food and drink. 16 days of observation, 24th of Burke. Essinger arrived in the camp before dawn, caused quite a stir. They immediately organized a group of group to transport the chest. After dusk, I'll try to track down where they carried it to. 17th day of observation, 25th of Burke. Don't... Didn't move the case that far away, just to the abandoned hut near the old mill, set up a wool watch, so I wasn't able to get closer. Eighth inning day of observation, 26th of Burke. Every man in the camp has been drinking since yesterday afternoon. If we attack now, we'll obliterate them. Too bad the commander only sent m one man, me, to this outpost. Try to sneak in tonight. If fortune smiles on me, perhaps one man will be enough. What'd he die to, though? Wolf? Wolves? Hmm. Strange. But that's it? I don't think it's part of a mission, is it? He said to the building next to the mill. Building next to the mill. Next to the mill. Is there anything? There is. Uh, I mean, I guess they're pretty far away. We'll come back. Yeah, it's closer. Come here, Roach. Let's go for a ride. I think, I think this trophy gives us dismember, 5% more dismemberment. Oh, I hit him. Wild horses. Dude, it would have been cool. They have the wild horses. I think you actually can't hop on their back, but it would have been cool if you could uh, snag. I, I don't know. Slow now. And I know there's a lot of things that they intended to keep wanting to get off the triangle. Um, I know there's a lot of things they intended to put in the game that ended up just not getting in the game. I'm not sure what the list is, but I see the wild horse groups, and I wouldn't be surprised if they were gonna put like have it so you could like like try and wrangle a horse and make it make it yours. The fact that you get the black horse, uh. The black horse roach. I feel bad for, you know, roach, but I like the black horse. Can't remember if that's DLC or if that's, um. I think that is DLC, isn't it? Isn't that in, uh. Where is. Oh, it's right there. It's nighttime, it's dark, forgive me. Actually blends into the night sky really well. Barbecue fruit. So there's all that building back there. I don't think I've. I don't think I've. Am I just hitting? No. If I hold the touchpad, it goes to inventory. I thought there was a button. I thought there was a button that just goes straight to... Oh, I missed all that. Was that 11 hide in there? Jeez. I, I totally missed all this stuff when we fought the... I feel so silly. That's good stuff. So, 
A windmill is either meant to generate power. Of, you know, it's, in, in the end, it's meant for generating electricity or it's meant for, like, making a, a mill to, like, grind stuff. What the heck is this thing doing? Like, what does this mill do? Oh, it's blocked off. Maybe it does do something in there. Because, first of all, look at that. <laughs> why is it so high off? I mean, like, why is it propped off the ground like that? Because it looks like it's... Looks like it's just... A mill for no idea. like getting my uh oh that one is that locked Let's getting more oils Key wire it says locked I never got a key Always open that chest. What's your three? Is it this one? Is that why there was a red? Headset is all right. Maybe this is where I get the key from. I was wondering why, like, all he's there's a red, like, usually, if there's a red um, outline on something. Faster, mm. I think this is the one. Nummy, nummy. 
mean to me. Oh yeah, four baby. There's a hall. My goodness. I love it when that happens. It's like he, he fell less than less than a foot. You know that sensation where like you're walking and you feel like you're gonna like you feel like the ground's either closer it, it feels like the ground's closer than it is when you put your foot down. And when you put it down, it, it's it, like you go to step and it's not, so you feel like you're fall, like you, like you feel like you're falling, but then you like you hit the ground all of a sudden. It's like, yeah, just get that sensation of falling. Which way is the quickest? This is not gonna be. Any And then the other, the other one is, is um, like you feel like uh, I hate the uh, the other one too. Is like uh, you think the ground's farther than away than it is. Like you're like you're gonna go take a step, like going up the steps. You you forget like or like you don't realize you're gonna go up. The ground is a lot closer. Like you're gonna um, you're you walk forward and there's a step in front of you. And you go to walk forward, and your foot hits the ground way earlier than you expected it to, and and you're just like, ow! But like, it, you still get a similar, uh, similar sensation. But it's just funny because Geralt does that too. He's like, he takes a takes a step forward, and he like, he falls half a foot, and he goes, oh my god! Slow now. All right, it's up here. This is an old castle. Oh, I remember this area. Okay. What? That was cool. But I can't. There we go. Your ass is mine. Oh, you son of a bitch! I can still ride my horse as long as I get to me horse you still get to walk at a respectable speed which is nice do you need to get that can't remember if you need to actually apply that that That's the other one I apply always is uh, the first thing is that weight upgrade. Luckily they doubled the weight. That was one quick thing they did in the updates. That was nice. Dude, the weight was so terrible when you first got the game. Scrawled notes. What am I supposed to fucking die for? Tamaria? Da died. Da died for that. So did my three brothers. And what'd that get them? Fuck all. That's what. Not even a decent burial. Da always said, a wise man learns from others' mistakes, so here I am, learning from his, and instead of dying for Tamaria, I'm going to rob those who killed Tamaria's sons. We pitched a camp, got us a great spot, middle of the woods, near the old mill, and now we're all set to go on our first raid. Sorry, guys. Shouldn't have killed, I mean, killed, shouldn't have attacked me. Looking for something. Mm, 
location, Amavet Fortress. Witcher, Colgrim stands accused of kidnapping Vidis and Paul, a beekeeper. White Orchard suspect was detained pending trial. Upon detention, he was searched, and a diagram for the forging of a steel sword was found in his person. It suspected this sword was used to intimidate or possibly. I suspected this sword. What? It's a diagram of a sword. And that how is a diagram of a sword used to intimidate? Oh. It's likewise suspected that the accused possesses other such diagrams in the forging of death dealing implements. But none have been found to date. <laughs> Great evidence. Sir Ignatius has requested the Witcher undergo preliminary interrogation with the application of torture. Uh, this will take place under torture with the proper qualifications has been found. It was later discovered drowners were responsible for the boy's disappearance. Oh, this is what those ladies were talking about in the town that one time. Unfortunately, Colgrim died before this information reached the investigators for rather than face the Baronet's judgment. He chose trial by ordeal. Sir Ignatius agreed in order he cleansed the Bereris, a family crypt of specters. Pilgrim never emerged from said crypt. Highly likely the, mom, the motley rays, specters, and evil powers resided therein proved too much for him. Except there was people inside that ended up killing him, it looks like. Serpentine steel sword. All right, so I didn't get a key. I have no idea where I'm, where that key is. Maybe I'll keep looking for it. All right, need to go sell some crap. Really, this guy is still working all night long? A return customer. Welcome. What can I do for you this time? Show me your wares. Ooh, actually, I want to see. I'd like you to forge something for me. This is what I got. But this is all he can. Oh, this is all he can craft. Do I have someone that can craft weapons? Who can craft weapons?
might keep I'll keep the ruins. I know I can get more stronger ones later. Actually, I'll probably end up putting them put some in my Save that. I know someone can give me 20 force. Luckily, this all this to crafting. Oh, I'm so happy crafting stuff does not cost. No weight to crafting stuff. Not realistic, but nice. So I gotta find out who can craft. Where'd you go all the way over there? Alright, so we didn't do this one all the way over here. What is over here? Sawmill. Oh, is that, um... Move it. Abandoned village, maybe? Are you already there? Was he always there? <laughs> it's like I'm very interested in this piece of wood. What the heck? Wolves everywhere. What the heck? Winds howling. Merchant. want this, but... What? I don't think I can kill him. You know what, I should probably save the game. I don't think I can... don't want to attack this target. Is 
it glitched? Or is it now you get, like I can't damage? I think I cannot. It's like considered part of the. Greetings. Greetings. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. I needed, I did need some honeysuckle, didn't I? Wait a minute, I, probably, I should probably check to see if. Farewell. I should probably see if I still need it before I buy it. I do, I need one honeysuckle. Need six buckthorn. I have drowner tongues. Dog tallow. The heck? Rhino grin. This. What is this? I need one more wolf spain. How do I pin? Let's see if he has any wolf spain. Greetings. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. Nope, no will Spain. I think bear hides later, but I think... Plant hats. One honeysuckle, please. Thank you. Dude, we are almost level three. Farewell. <laughs> Nothing left but to pray. Beg evil spares us at least. You know, Witcher, folk can say what they will. Me, we I'll shouldn't. never forget what I can't lose hope. Nothing left but the Oh, jeez. It sounded like somebody was doing something inappropriate there. We sh no, we shouldn't. We shouldn't. We can't lose hope. No, Barry, my husband's right outside. Next place. All right, ransacked village, fjord. Nothing left but the plague. What other quests do we have here? I 
seen it actually. That's down. I think that quest is down there. Let's go ahead and highlight that one. Come on. Oops. Oh, Excuse me, buddy. Hey there. Any of her stuff respawn? Did. Give me that rib leaf. I actually need some rib leaf for some stuff later. All them good stuff. Stay where you're supposed to stay, horse. I love it when they clump this stuff together. It's so easy to gather. Sorry, lady. Man, it went, it went through like a whole day. I don't know why it does that. Like you clear a village, abandoned village thing, and it does like a whole day rotation. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to... Greetings. Let me have a look at your stock. I don't know if... How much does this cost? Twenty-nine. Do I have anything else to sell him? Let's see what we got here. Screw we'll just go ahead and sell all this stuff for now. This is five percent. We'll keep that one. We'll get better ones. This is just really early game.
Take care. All right, you are now, you've got a new Gwent card. If you want to examine it, open the game menu and go to Gwent deck panel. Hi, dog. Hi. Hi, what are you doing? What you doing? Hi. Hi. Oh wait, did I not grab the headpiece? I didn't. Oops, I hit the wrong thing. Greetings. Let me have a look at your stock. Take care. Oh yeah, all right, that's not bad. I don't think I hit the... are those houses? Right, now I got 90 pounds weight. The guard stuff is always, I think, is the coolest looking. I also like the, uh... The DLC. Oh, cool. I, I was like, oh my gosh. Yeah. Uh, there's some good stuff. Fire. Perfect. This game is a hoarder's like, like dream. Give me all of it. All of it. You got me honeycomb. Guessing I'll get in trouble for stealing out of their stuff. Yeah. 
Come lay down, Popper. Come on. Lay down. Oh my goodness. Lay down. Lay oh my goodness. I can't see, dog. I can't see. Hi. You're so cute. You're so cute. We'll go outside in a little bit. You lay down. Lay down. Plant you pick is basically a gold. We'll look for Bastion later once it's safe. Do that often? Talk to your dog? It's my brother's, Bastion's. But I guess he's mine now. See, Bastion Our dog, look at all the scars. Just outside the village. I haven't had word of him since. I told him, do like I did. Lose a finger or two so they won't recruit you. Too damn afeard he was. I was gonna say, do they show his hands? Is this model actually missing? I'd walk the battlefield if I were you. I did. Sea of corpses. And corpses feeding. Someone told me they're afeard of fire, so I took a torch, tried to chase them off. Horse shite, I tell you. Would have ended up eaten alive if it weren't for Hussar here. Listen, guessing you carry those swords for more than show. Come with me. Keep the ghouls off. Help me find Bastion and I'll pay you well. Fine, I'll help you. Just been a few days since the battle. Chances we find yeah, I still think he's slim. got his fingers. Very slim. Did he not take his thought, fingers off? I guess we only saw one of his hands. Body at least. So Bastion don't rot there in the sun with the black ones. Meet me on the hill overlooking the battlefield. We'll move on together from there. I think his mo yeah, I think his model still has all of his fingers. Come on, CD. Did you scrimp on that? silver
Bandits calling themselves to million show soldiers are hiding in nearby woods. They've been declared outlaws and threats to the Emperor's subjects. Doesn't think those are the ones we dealt with. Alright, let's save the game. Especially on the harder difficulties, this is it can be easy to mess up. You're here, good. Bastion. His body must be here somewhere. Among countless others. Want to examine them one by one? Could take a while. You needn't fret. The recruits from White Orchard painted a small flower on their shields so as to be able to spot each other in battle. There was just a few of them. We look for the flowers, we'll find Bastion quick. No offense, but many a soldier's dropped his shield. Especially if he was on the losing side. If we find the shield alone, Hassan will catch the scent and lead us to Bastion. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. Uh, objectives will sometimes direct you to general areas when the exact position of your target is unknown. That's not that's my steel sword. So many corpses. And the war's just started. These things rusted quick. I thought the battle just happened days ago. I got raw meat off of that horse. That might not be good to eat. Especially if all this stuff is rusty already. That's what I want. Peace. Let me find tracks or other clues. Yes, I know. That him? No. Doesn't look anything like him. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, still not. Uh, skin's burned off. Might be hard to tell, I know, but could this be him? Bastion was big, broad shouldered. This one seems smaller. But maybe it's the fire did that. What? He found him! Hassar's caught his scent! Come on! Come on. Got stuck on that body. But there is more. My lieutenant demanded we defecate on command. Ballista bolts landing all around, and all he could say was, A soldier with a full stomach will not step onto the battlefield. Now shit, that is an order. Can you believe it? The cretin. Stop! Oh, you're, oh, you're killing me. My, my ribs. Oh, it hurts to laugh. That needs a tourniquet. But first... Want to explain what's going on here? Bastion! Is he... Has this Nilf Guardian captured you? No. He saved my life. I, I got a cut to me side. And then got hit in the head. Couldn't see anything. Rosin here found me as... As he crawled across the battlefield. His legs twisted. And so we were. Blind man, leading a cripple. Found this place. I'm taking you home. We need to see to these wounds. I won't leave Rose in here. I'll own he'll die. And he can't go back to his home. He's deserted. They'll hang him. What? And what if they can't he, with us? Can't 
can't he just? I'm I'm kind of confused. I mean, if he's got twisted legs, can't he go back saying that? Like, if he comes crawling back, he's like, I crawled back from the battlefield. <laughs> Bastion only made it with the Black One's help. Maybe you ought to show him Nordlings aren't as barbarous as Nilfgaardians make us out to be. Well, I could give him our pa's clothes, teach him to work the field, but that accent... Fine, I'll take him in. Thank you, Witcher. Your reward, and the gods protect you. I think this is the one story that ends with a semi-good ending. Because I think you can actually see them together in a field at some point. And I don't think you ever see like anything bad happen to them. Sometimes a lot of bad shit happens, but once in a while a good thing happens in the game. I, I don't get it though, why he can't go back to his army. like. I don't know how they think he's abandoned, like if he comes back injured with twisted legs, you know, if he literally comes back, returns to the thing, it's like, I don't understand, like, uh, if you return to the army, you'd be like, you return injured, you'd be like, I wasn't able to return, like, I, like, you return injured, like, <laughs> he literally was not able to return, like, I can understand, like, they would be like, Gustav, I've got something to ask of you. I've come into the possession of quite the stash of valuables. Don't ask how. Modesty prevents me from accompanying the heroic deeds I performed in the fight for our beloved fatherland. At any rate, there's so damned much of it. There's no way in hell I'll carry it back on my own. So I put everything in a chest and buried it in the beach. The base of the cliff with the two burned out huts on it. You know you'd go crayfish hunting there, remember? So here's what you got to do. Grab a wheelbarrow, throw a shovel in it, and take it to the beach. Make sure no one sees you. We'll load the treasure and sell it in Vizima and split the earnings 50-50 like family should. See you later. Remember, not a word to anyone. How's my weight doing? That worked good. Easy money. There's a monster nest here. And a piece of power. Oh, dang it. A dag nabbit. Oh, dag nabbit. I had Kuhn lined up. How? of power should draw from it. Google nest on a 
just destroy it. No drop. I thought he was gonna wanted him to drop something. I get like it would make sense there's skulls in here, but oh man. I totally forgot I got this and then make it. Killer whale. Need the buckthorn. Let's go. We need to go for a swim. What sign is that? Oh, that was Kuhn, wasn't it? Yeah, it's Kuhn. Oh my goodness. I didn't realize that too. Oh, already up to five. Twenty-five percent extra damage on the quick attack. Yeah yeah. Alright, what's nearby? A pupper. Scour the battlefield a little more. I love getting raw meat off the dead horses. That's uh, just great. You're fine, my poor p <laughs> Stop whining. Oh my goodness, you're fine. You stop it. You stop whining. We're gonna go outside in just a minute, though. Oh my goodness. Oh, stop it. Stop it. Now she's nudging my hand. She wants attention. Stop it. Stop it. Oh my goodness. Bananas. Stop it. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Thank you. 
take the coins. Yeah. Like, why would you take coins in with you into battle? I guess you might be able to buy your way out of something. Roach, let's go. I love it that you can just ride your horse. Let's go. Come on, Roach. monster nest up here oh dear cannot see them in these bushes there we go lock on and gives me a little bit better I don't like being locked onto one guy when there's so many. Roach, do something. Kick him. I wish Roach would kick. Come on, kick. Help me. Destroy it. Monster? Oh. Ghost blood, gold ring, monster claw. And climb up right here. Break the 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 attack quick. Normally they get like a one attack in like that. I keep getting the double attacks.
Arbor Forest. Hunter's Boots and Hack Decoction. Let's see, is there anything I can make? Oh, I need one more Drowner Tongue. Right by the water, I don't think... Is there any Buckthorn in there? Doesn't look like it. I need to go to the river. Alright, we're gonna go into town and sell this stuff. I think we've hit all... The only thing we missed is that one chest, and I don't... Oh wait, there is a chest. Uh, we can actually get it on the way up to turning in the main quest. Let's go sell this stuff. It's three. We might need to rest. Make sure world map. One. Let's see if I go over here in this reef. Oh wait, there's something right here. Come on. Oh jeez, oh no. Oh, I got them both? What? Okay. Oh, you little sucker. I will take that. Always like me some hard alcohol. Always good to do the money it gives you. Good the fact that it replenishes your stuff. Good ooh, wolf liver. Anything else? So we're gonna hit this up. This this is the glitch. It was glitched. I'm pretty sure. I cleared it out. I killed the ghouls, but n nobody came back. I think if you do like a wait, I pup her. She's putting like she putting her paw on my arm. Hmm. Now oh, she's whining. Okay. All right. We'll go outside. Oh my goodness. She's just so adorable. That's a big yawn. Yes, okay, okay. Shh. Shh. Maybe if I meditate right here. Uh, maybe they'll show up. Let's go. Oh, no, they should back up. There was one left somewhere. That or they res they spawned it in to try and get, you know, to fix the problem. What now, you piece of filth? Finally, there we go. Either it fixed itself because, uh, you know, I saved and quit and came back in. At least, it, at least that happened. That or this guy was wandering around somewhere and it... Except I think that we went... Oh my gosh, it did. It, it was like 3 in the morning and now it's 7 at night. Gonna have to...
All right, well, that's that's done. All right, so we got one Ooh. chest. Well, technically two chests, but I don't know where that key is. So unless I find that key... I might do a little searching off stream. See if I can't find it. Make a look. Any other question marks? This down. There's that. Gotta find something near the river, it said. <laughs> You're all right. Lay down. Lay down. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh. That's the one thing the AI really, really needed to work on. Look at this. They will rock, walk right into you. There's some games that I've played. I think Grand Theft Auto, uh, I've seen has like um, some. Was it Grand Theft Auto? No, what was I playing? It was um, Mafia. One of the Mafia games, where the AI really like, like, like noticeably gets out of your way if you get near them with a car or something like. A return customer. Welcome. What can I do for you this time? Show me what you got. I only got 20, I only got 24 coin. Trying to think, is there any dark steel stuff? Does he have this probably later game? No. I can probably sell some stuff. There's a trader, I believe. There is a trader up at the um Come on. Oh my goodness, at the Nelfgard camp. Oh, 
Get the nilfs. Always oh, sounds like it's they're saying milfs. Just going through this, the landscape, the scenery, it's just so great. The coloration too, like look at this orange, beautiful nighttime, the sunset going down. Oh. That's why I really wish they had given uh, Cyberpunk. It's like, man, you guys should have just like been like, guys, Cyberpunk is just not ready yet. We're gonna cook it for a couple more years. People would have been like, Let's I know go. people would have been angry as hell, but a lot of people would have been like, they're just like, really, it's really not done yet. You, <laughs> we don't want to, we don't want a bad launch like The Witcher having all the issues, and it, it, I would have been like, okay, that was easy. Wasn't expecting it to be that easy. There's some drowners hiding down there. But why didn't dive? Dive. What's going on? Dive. Just a mad. I don't know how they could do. It's like I get that they got bigger and stuff. To whom it may concern, by the order of the Legion Commander, the men bearing this miss missive are to be escorted north to the border post near Oxenfurt. They will find a Redanian division waiting for them. As noble born Temerians, they are under special protection and not a hair on their heads to be harmed. Everything they carry is their own private property and to remain in their possession. Any failure to heed the order will be punished. Accelerated military accelerated, accelerated military tribunal. Randall Wittenberg. Maybe this is where the key... Oh, maybe this is where the... Oh, this is... Okay, this is where the... That's where the... Okay. That's kind of annoying, but... I mean, I found, um... I mean, I found that I, I found the guy. I found that the guy that um, found somebody that spied the guys that killed these guys. That's kind of cool, though. And I don't think I've ever really connected those two. That I was watching Rodanian. No, was it? Yeah, Rodanian spy watching bandits who attacked these people. And took their stuff and hit it here, but they didn't have a key, which they missed, which was amongst the stuff in the water. But you had to find the key first and the body on the lake, which then unlocks a chest in the river, which then gets you a key. Oh, come on. I've already found this one. Found it. To Marion Rye. Ooh, that's nice. Special Forces Insignia, Script Document, Crowns, Enhanced Saddle. No wonder you're losing. Hemi, no wonder you're losing this war with cowardly cunts for soldiers. All it took were a few arrows and a wallop of the mace for seasoning, and that was that. Battle was over, and the whole convoy was ours for the picking. Maybe they were having such a hard time of it because all that vodka they were carrying. Our brave war warriors must have taken a sip from time to time with obvious results. When you're seeing double, it's damned hard to hit your target. Take everything we gather to the cubby, then fence it quick as you can, except the showy parade shite. You'll have to bury it or burn that. I reckon someone might recognize the insignia. Then there to be trouble. So... Let me see here. 
what is this? A enhanced saddle. What is the difference? Look, I want to see what the difference looks like. I think I'm going to like the Temerian saddle better, so I could probably sell this one. I do like the Temerian saddle. It's a nice one with the flowers on the side. Let's see what the Temerian and the superior saddle looks like. I got a lot of gold and stuff. I didn't recognize that. Oh yeah, I like the Temerian saddle better. Yeah, it looks nice. I go potty. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Yes, she does. Oh my goodness. Okay. Okay. Oh my god. Oh, <laughs> she like got up, went over, like took two steps to the right, and like plopped over on top of me. Okay. Err. Err. Oh, you're such a menacing dog. Such a menacing dog. Oh. Oh. All right. Come on. Come on. Let's go. All right. I will be right back. Give me about two minutes. Creakety creak. Oh, look at that gorgeous. Even at the nighttime. Oh, and the stars. I never realized how pretty it was. Even on the PS4, which, you know, I mean, the PS4 is nice and everything, but, like, it looks nice on the computer. Like, the um, computer, it's gorgeous. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, 
That was quick. It was quick. haven't we? Looks like it. Like some of these old structures is, um, even like, like this is like the pe like it's funny because like even this is old. Like, like even in this time, like they have old structures. Like how long ago was this? A hundred years ago? Fifty years ago? How old is this? Like look how it. Where does that even go? Let me see where this is. Is that the northern part of the map? Get on that side. Looks like you can. Heard of the Flyhead Brigade? Your kind, sir. Non humans. I remember trying to take stuff from in front of these guards the first time. They just like went like Make way. because uh, like you could take stuff inside houses and no one would do anything. And then I would like I went to go and take stuff. What the hell is this? Roy, you take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. I I didn't know. So a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a nout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! At least they're not killing you. What? Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tcha! A moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell me why you've come. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? 
to Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time, under my nose. Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the Griffin. Tit for tat. Those idioms of yours. Halt. We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. You're still gonna be alive, dude. The arson guy got killed. I did the job. I can get the coin. It's better than he have the coin. Vesemir! Alright, now my horse is having it. My horse is having issues. It's going down the wrong. When did you go from the main road to the smaller road? Didn't sell stuff. I'm not going back. Not going back. I should be close enough. Slower. I want to talk to her real quick, make sure there's nothing. Oh, that's my chest. Is there anything I want to keep in there? So. Jennifer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Time we were on our way. Buy some provisions for the journey, then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it just this once. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down to hang a golden sun there now. Cannot show Temerian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fund of the Imperials. You Nilfgaard's whore. I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to Let my son tending to the birth, and you don't oh. fear the gods' wrath. You don't oh. fear it, you cunt! Leave me be!
recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? Jesus Christ. Fuck that woman. That's true. What the Emperor promised you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. And neither are you. They won't back down now. I can see that. I love how I turn their bandits. <laughs> Gotta make them bad guys. Are the villagers? It's all right. It's over. <laughs> Why are you being nice to her? She's the bitch that started it. Fuck that cunt. See his face. God save us! Be gone. And don't ever come back. So much for not getting involved. Come on, let's go. They deserved. They got what they deserved. That brawl, we didn't start it. I think I have the alternate costumes on. Excuses, excuses. You've not changed a bit. Y Yen? How? I received a report about a witcher who'd appeared in White Orchard. I knew it was you, looking for me. I might have waited until you found me, but... Oh, you know me. Patience has never been my strong suit. It's good to see you, Geralt. I... I'd even embrace you. Were you not covered in blood? Sorry. Wasn't expecting to see you. To be honest, this isn't at all how I imagined we'd meet. How did you imagine it? You didn't imagine you'd have a Nilfgaardian escort. Don't get me wrong, Yennefer. I'm glad to see you. But I do think you owe us an explanation. And I shall provide it. In Vizima. Ready your horses. We can talk here. Some charming orchards nearby. In bloom even. So you almost can't smell the corpses. A tempting proposition. Sadly, I must say no. You see, someone awaits you in Vizima. Someone who doesn't like to be kept waiting. Emperor Emir Var Emrys, or to those on more intimate terms with him, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Doubt I number among that group, for as I remember, last time we saw each other, he wanted to kill me. Well, now he wishes to make you an offer. The kind one can't refuse? I didn't, though I could have. Fine. I guess I'm willing to hear him out. The Emperor of Nilfgaard, Lord of Metina, Ebbing, and Gamera, Sovereign of Nazare and Vicovaro, will feel honored, I'm sure. What about you? I'm going in the opposite direction. I somehow doubt the Emperor's invitation mentioned me. Besides, I've got things to do at Kaer remember? Yeah, I remember. Thanks for your help, Vesemir. See you soon. How's your horse? Swift? Can't complain. Why do you ask? I'd like to be back behind some thick city walls as soon as possible. how they get blood out of their outfits.
Isn't Vizima to the south? White Orchard? You know, I had a dream about you recently. Knowing you, it was probably filthy. Just the beginning. But then... But then... <sighs> Weird thinking there's some like there's some sort of elves under there. Those those armor outfits. Jennifer, how big? We shall talk of this tomorrow. All right, after the audience. This bard's tale begins near White Orchard, with my dear friend Geralt of Rivia seeking his lover of yore, the sorceress Yennefer. She'd eluded him for years, but now seemed just a few steps ahead. After many trials and tribulations, Geralt finally learned that Yen was in nearby Vizima. I always wondered why they didn't use the just the voice actor. I guess it's like supposed to be what Dandelion when he's older telling his tale. I made him really old and gruff. Ladies. Ladies. Hmm. It must suffice. Think of your cares if I'm clean. The gentleman will refer to his Imperial Majesty by his full title or not at all. The gentleman will be seated on the berger. The what now? In that chair. Tetwin, please shave the gentleman's sideburns to half an inch. What's wrong with my beard? Always thought it added to my dignity. It does. Yet it also detracts from your elegance. In Nilfgaard, we consider beards hard on the eyes. Especially beards infested with lice. Been on the road a while. Fine. Do your thing. Tilt your head back, please. And sit still. And prepare to answer some questions. General, I am not certain this is the appropriate time. I can't think of a better time. Men turn honest when they feel a blade at their throat. Movran Vuris, commander of the Alba Division. Before they take you in to see the Emperor, which, uh, there's some information I need you to verify. It's a formality. But one that must be seen to. Sure. Paperwork's gotta be in order. So, Geralt of Rivia. Place of birth, unknown. Parents, unknown. Age, unknown. All insignificant details. Let us proceed to more recent events. The siege of La Valette Castle. The fate of the defending commander, one Arya.
We fought on opposing sides, true. Then we landed in the same dungeon. Arian escaped, set fire to the castle on his way out. Ah. So that is how the blade started. Our reports suggested the dragon was responsible. Moving on. You then found shelter in charming Flotsa, and from there made your way to Vergen. My question is how? I left Flotsam with Yorvith, commander of a Squiatel unit. A slayer of monsters and a slayer of men. You forge interesting alliances. Something tells me my most interesting is yet to come. Go on, next question, before my beard grows back in. We shall shave you again if it does. Very well. The infamous summit at Loch Muin. You were there. I remember the details of the second game. In the of the Not at all. I meddled in a personal affair. Helped Yorvith lift the spell that held Saskia. Yes. And in doing so, gave Radovid a reason to begin his witch hunts. Congratulations. Nilfgaard recently started a war, unprovoked. So do us both a favor and stop moralizing. The gentleman must sit still. I'm almost done. I'm afraid I might find that difficult. Because, from what I know, shortly afterwards you watched a defective megascope blow your friend Sheila de Tanserville to bits. I watched her get in the megascope, but ultimately freed her from the trap your man Letho of Gullet had set. Write that down. I want to be sure the paperwork's in order now. Well, national interest calls on one to forge difficult alliances at times. Alliances with witches included. That an ongoing alliance? What's Letho up to? I had hoped you would answer that question. Ah, so Letho's hiding from you. Must have a good reason. Was there a shift in national interest that might have caused that? I don't know where he is. Wouldn't tell you if I did anyway. Blade or no blade to my throat. I believe that is all. Your signature, please, affirming you stated the whole truth and nothing but the truth on pain of imprisonment or death, etc., etc. Here and here. With these formalities seen to, I would ask the general to leave the room. We shall be choosing the gentleman's attire. An important matter? but one that does not require the general's assistance. Shame. I might have given you some advice. So long, Gallant. Good luck with your audience. Feels more like I'm being readied for a wedding. Were that so, I would have prepared the gentleman a frock, a tailcoat, or possibly a dinner jacket. In point of fact, the gentleman will choose from these garments. Black, black, or black. We do not like garish colors in Nilfgaard. The gentleman will tell me once he has chosen an outfit. I was going to say, can I equip armor? No, I can't. Oh, shit. Oh, my trousers are... Huh. <laughs> it's funny. Remember which one I tend to choose.
And they say clothes do not make the man. Does the outfit satisfy the gentleman? A studded doublet and a sword on my back, that's what would satisfy me. But tough, when in Nilfgaard. Yes. It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the ruler of the North and South. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. Confirm away. Please watch. Leg extended. Hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The gentleman will rehearse. Hmm, lacking fluidity and grace. But we've learned to expect less of Nordlings. Come with me. The gentleman will address the Emperor only when asked to, and using the appropriate title. Your yes, Arch Magnificency. I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests. I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition. Your Majesty will suffice. Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Grimmi et art kerze. Daifen aden in karn eb marvut. Emir var emreis. Bow. I only do it because otherwise that poor guy gets beaten. Arer ep do orde. Avelian Namin, what can forward? Feel bad for him. Your actions have consequences for others as well. I thought you bowed before no man. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter, Cyrilla, she's returned. And she's in danger. The wild... Really, look at Cyrilla's face. <laughs> you will find her and bring her to me. She, like, hates that dress. Are you sure? Siri left, went far, far away. Do you believe I drag you here in the middle of a war? To discuss a rumor. I think anyone can be wrong, even an emperor. I had forgotten how insolent you can be. I haven't the time to convince you, nor the desire, in fact. Yanifu will do that after the audience. How many men in your army? 20,000? 30? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. She trusts me. Yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. If for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. I need information, not motivation. Siri leaves few tracks. She'll be hard to find. My corps of spies will help you. Count on them and my army, should the need arise. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meririd! Take him to the sorceress. Thank you.
Follow me, if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace, whom the gentleman... Disgusts. ...need not bother. Hey, Witcher. Don't need anything. In the morning, and it's past noon. Calm yourself. What? What? Do you know who you're talking to, soldier? I'm Herevard II, Prince the of Helanda. Not only am I made yeah. to wait here like some I'm supplicant. Radsliden e enet. Ted de tage in den kalantne se voloi so. Ep tu so? Mind if I interrupt? Why not join in instead? We're discussing neutrality. How difficult it is to preserve. Still worth trying. Because? Because there are few causes worth serving, even fewer men. Enough about that. Mind if we change the subject? So, talk to the Emperor. Hmm. Why did he summon you? So not even you know. No. But I wager it's an ordinary witch's contract. Mm-hmm. Some weirbubs. See you. Soon, mind you. Kind of wish there was more to that, but I guess not. Anyway. Oh, yeah. The gentleman will have time for a stroll later. Please stay with me. Er så vatka. Er så må jeg strække en etfold til at stige stuff. Dangerous. Dangerous, Dennis. Let's find no one. Stay with me. Shake to vin. He doesn't care about. Shush. What was that? Heard of the Bry Head Brigade? You're dying, sir. Not you. Tessa Glenken at Lord Master. And Selfit then sick ya. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Well sharpened yet. Yes? Then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchant's guild, but the church of the eternal fire and the criminal underworld. At times it is difficult to tell the one from the other. They both display a similar ruthlessness and cynicism that... Please wait, Your Excellency. I'm falling behind. You know what? I'll write the report myself. You'll need only prepare a clean draft. In triplicate. I have no idea what the heck they use these giant green tanks for. I see them all over the place. Looks like large enough to keep a body in. What do you mean? Directly out of Nordling Tate. Geralt, that tunic, you look positively smashing. Ugh, dying to take it off. I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I'm at Emir's court? Mm-hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back? No chance he's mistaken? Look. That's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady.
There's no female witchers, right? How about that? She's grown up. It's been years since you trained together at Kaer Morn. A great deal has changed. You haven't. Not a bit. I missed those awkward compliments of yours. But let's focus on Ciri, all right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Ciri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the wild hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd tricked them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. You must find her, Geralt. Before the Wild Hunt does. The Wild Hunt? What could it want from Ciri? I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. I know as much as you do. It must be about her blood. Her gift. As for what the Hunt wishes to do with that gift, I... I prefer not to think about it, really. So where has Ciri been seen, exactly? In two places. Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords? Secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see Someone's me. Someone's jealous. You? What will you do? I shall sail for Skelliger. There was a magic explosion there recently. Blew half a forest down. I believe this had something to do with Ciri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I didn't want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. Ah, oh, bitch. Damn. I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? It, yes! <laughs> Let's drop it, alright? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't like, wish to hear it. If, if you can't remember somebody, how do you expect them to, like... Oh my gosh, I hate that. Like, literally. I didn't have, like... I didn't know you even existed. That's your excuse. And then as soon as he found out about you, like, remembered you, he came looking for you. But I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to I mean, in the long run, I like it, but she is the jealous type. Have it your way? Oh, and you really look quite dashing in black velvet. Think so? Maybe I can have some of my own. I guess Trist is, like, her best friend, so... Same to you. It is the worst person if you wish to learn for him to have screwed with. That's Triss's fault. She Talk knew. Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt, I know it's wartime, but try not to be a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. I shall be waiting. I was playing when I was playing Witcher 2 the whole time. It was just like, why the heck were we even looking for Yennefer? Like, dude, just stop looking for Yen. You got Triss right here. I thought that's the way the story was gonna go. I thought it was like, by the end, like you were gonna stop looking for Yennefer, and you were gonna end up with Triss. Because I I hadn't played The Witcher one.
I really would like them. That would be another one too. Remaking The Witcher 1 or PS4 or, you know, PS5. That'd be good. I'd uh, get CD Projekt Red back in some people's good graces. Can I take that picture? It says read. Oh, I can just look at it. Scars healed nicely. Dude, that picture, it's so funny, that picture of her hanging up in a, the Emperor's room. She looks so angry, getting stuck in that dress. My little sister's got a picture like that. She's got like the sweater on. The, uh, I can't remember where we got the sweater, but so it stuck her in this sweater and she is not happy. Gummy, that stuff. Picture's gauntlets. Griffin, de Griffin decoction. We, what did we kill? Killed something. It was a, it's a it was a type of g griffin. We did. Um. Griffin mutagen. Awesome. Taking damage raises damage resistance up to an upper limit for the remainder of the fight. Oh, I can make a bomb. Finds opponents with the explosives radius, destroys monster nests. A grape shot. I need one more calcium. Sulfur. Calcium and sulfur. Yennefer suggested I ask you about current events, the war and so on. Of course. The Emperor's servants should keep no secrets from each other. If you will, let us approach the map. Am I going to discuss something in my eye? Give me a second. the war going? I mean, apart from the fact that Nilfgaard's triumph is imminent. I assume this to be a private conversation. We've no witnesses, so let's dispense with the propaganda, even that shrouded in irony. Our offensive was going splendidly until winter came. Edern was in such disarray that we encountered no resistance. We had reached the Pontar before the first snows. Only a weakened Kedwin remained and Radovid's Redania, which had ignored the rest of the North's pleas for help. We thought they'd sue for peace, perhaps even submit to vassalization. We waited for spring, certain of victory. Radovid? Submit? Yes, a vain hope, I agree. Radovid sent no peace envoys, nor did he advance on our positions. Instead, he trudged over the snow-bound Kestrel Mountains and attacked Kedwin his ally. This attack took the Kedweni by surprise. They were still mourning the loss of their king. Rudderless and dejected, they laid down their arms after a few lost skirmishes and joined Radovid. And so by spring, instead of two weak enemies, we had only one powerful one. What about Kavir? Kavir values its neutrality. Enough not to lend its armies, or more importantly, even its coin to either side. Returning to the war, this spring there was a massive battle in the marshes of Velen. Massive, yet indecisive. Both sides suffered enormous losses. Unprecedented, even. Radovid has retreated across the Pontar. He's safe for now, until reinforcements arrive from the south. Then... Emperor Emir Var Emrys will deal with him once and for all. 
Couldn't you just go home? Save everyone a lot of marching, not to mention a few human lives. I'm afraid the stakes are too high to fold now. We can only go all in. Hmm. How do things look in Velen? As bad as ever. Perhaps worse. This land never flowed with milk and honey, and now it flows with blood. Armies have swept through it several times. Trampling fields, looting granaries, burning villages. Famine grips the populace. Mm-hmm. So how's ruling that earthly paradise going for you? Not well, to be honest. Our forces are spread thin as it is, and Velen is chiefly swampy forests that are difficult to control. We've had several patrols never return to their camps. Thus, we've temporarily delegated authority in this region to a certain Nordling, a former low-ranking officer in the Temerian army, one Philip Strenger, better known by his nom de guerre, Bloody Baron. Baron. I advise you well. Avoid him. Any news from Novigrad? Is the free city still free? Yes. Although everyone knows this won't last. Radovid is in Oxenford, and the Emperor is here, in Vizima, at Novigrad's doorstep, both. And both require coin and ships. And Novigrad can provide these. Which is why the mood in the city is rather, well, on edge. Meaning? How do men deal with fear? They seek reassurance and scapegoats. The Church of the Eternal Fire understands this perfectly, and so it promises to improve the lives of its flock by pointing out the guilty. Who started the war? Who profits from it? Why, it's obvious. Mages, elves, dwarves, in a word, any and all deviants. I've been stationed in Novigrad for 13 years. First as a consul, then as ambassador. I've seen a great deal. Cruelty, cynicism, greed. But what is happening there now concerns me greatly. Yeah, just burning it. Oh my gosh, just burning everyone. Really hate that you can't do more there. Like when you first arrive, it's just seeing people burnt at the stakes. There is a couple of people that you can save, which is nice. What's new in Skellige? Nothing. The islanders pride themselves on that, don't they? Doing everything according to tradition, as their forefathers did. And like their forefathers, they quarrel with each other. Pillage. Occasionally attack our transports. This is cumbersome, but nothing more. Skellige has always been a footnote to history. And so it shall remain. Sound awfully confident. What if King Bran manages to unite the Jarls? Lead all the clans against your fleet? King Bran is a feeble old man. From what I know, he barely remembers the names of his own vassals. Uniting all might prove difficult. Thanks for your help. Think nothing of it. May the great sun light your path. Looking at that map, it's crazy how much of it is controlled by the uh, Elfgard now. Look at it. There's just a few small states like Toussaint that are somehow able to stay independent. I grabbed it. This is in uh, it's her side. I grabbed everything. Alright, let's get our gear back, and I think when we head out, that will be the end of... How might I serve the gentleman? By returning my things. Give me my shit! Citrus and cloves. The fragrance will keep the gentleman's robes fresh somewhat longer. Mm. Thanks, bunches. Keep the fleas and flies the away. The is not known for his patience. He wants his daughter back safe and sound. As soon as possible. Yeah, mention something of the sort. So long. What was she doing? She looked like she was reaching, like, pulling out a wedgie, that one. This 
I wonder if the language they're speaking is an actual language. I, I never know. I never like found out if that was something. Because I know, like, um, what is the? It's a uh, Polish, right? The author uh, is Polish. So are they? Are the Nilf Guardians speaking Polish? What are you doing, Bob? Nice, Teda to. What are you doing, dog? What? Oh, <laughs> she just le leaped on me. Hi. Oh, this is the, uh... What do you want under? Dear Sir Roderick DeWitt, please forgive me for the lardy, lardy, tardy response. I can't even tell it's a T. I was waiting for Golan Vivaldi to confirm sufficient funds were available to redeem the bill of exchange you provided. Not that I don't trust you, but the gods help those who help themselves, as the Kedwini saying goes. Getting straight to your question, Princess Ada's curse could indeed be cause return. The Witcher from Rivia had only a rudimentary knowledge of magic arcana, so was not able to fully remove the spell, and instead only temporarily disrupted his workings. For Ada to become a Striga once more, one would have to sprinkle her food with three drops of blood from her father, King Foltis, three drops of blood from a wolf, and three drops of bile from a freshly buried woman, one who died having finished 100 years, but not at Having started her hundred and first, then w you drops of bile. It's bile, anyways. It's not feces, is it? Uh, then w well, one must cause the incepted cast the incepted triangle over the meal thus prepared. That should do the trick. Yeah, please consider. Carefully whether you truly wish to carry out such an ignoble deed, hoping to do business again with you in the future. Elisandra Deville. I don't... Did she get turned back into a... That's King Falsa's daughter, right? I never read the book, but I did see the first season of The Witcher, which was I thought was all right. Though the the editing confused the fuck out of me at first. Heard of the Vryhead Brigade? Your kind, sir. Non-humans. Mm hmm. Oh, Gwent. See you. I'm trying to remember, is there anything? The world map. Enter there. That's where we came. It's the only area I haven't been is over here, right? Somebody lost their head. Shake and 
2v. Is there anything up here? Any gutters? Meteorite ingot. That's good. Nurse Hen as queen. Oops. Gerald's a sturdy boy. Duchy of Toussaint. Toussaint. So. Just do. Oh, it went right in. Geralt and Yennefer were reunited, but something even more important happened in Vizima. Geralt learned that Cirilla, his one-time ward, had returned from afar, and she was in danger. He was to find her at the Emperor's command and Yennefer's behest. I think... I think Bloody Baron is probably like one of the, the side quests. Like, I think it's one of the secondary. I mean, I guess you kind of have to go through it. It's part of the main quest, but you don't really have to finish it at the end. You could ignore it afterwards. Uh, yeah, it's one of the secondary quests. I think it's one of the characters that, like, it's one of the secondary characters that I think is one of the most interesting. Um. It just really shows such a tortured person. I guess like a, what like what it would it might be like to kind of live through this time period. Like a lot of times we romanticize it, it's fantasized and stuff. You fantasize and romanticize. It's kind of, kind of the Arthurian, King Arthur kind of fantasized. Or romanticized stuff. Or at least, you know, like the productions. I don't know really about the book. Like, I don't know about the actual stories, but like, like movies, TV shows, that kind of stuff. Everything in this game looks great, except them damn crows. <laughs> Still got that head hanging. Thank you for purchasing the Heart of Stone expansion. I didn't set it to that, that's weird. Playing the Heart of Stone expansion, you can encounter a rune right. But in wine. Anything else? Oh, I didn't do it, okay. Alright, here is where we're going to, um... We're gonna stop this stream. I'm going to go get a bite to eat when we come back. I think we will start, uh, the next video. Uh, 
Crazy. Continue to play the Witcher, and then we will go on and play some Kinna Bridge of Spirits. Get close to finishing that. I think I'm gonna try to keep most videos down to between um like three to four hours now. Just to help for uploading uh and lengthwise. Also try to end them at uh kind of key key points. Story points. So we just ended we just talked to Emperor von Izmir. And got our main quest. We are now headed to um, hey, uh. Uh, talk t to find the Bloody Baron eventually. And that's gonna be guide wanted. Keep a plea. That's a heed. That elvish. Seen why. I think that quest is the werewolf one, isn't it? I've seen wife, yep. Alright, so we're gonna end it here. But I will be back later to stream some more. Let's go ahead and save. Four. Thank you for watching. Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, um, I'm also on Twitch at um, the Armchair Grump. Um, you can get uh, videos there. You can watch me there live, or you can see uh, videos um, there early. I uh, try to do at least uh, upload a video uh, once or twice a day. Uh, some of my streams, but they're kind of back backlogged. <laughs> Um, so, um, I'm trying to get them loaded to YouTube. Uh, mainly right now is playthroughs, um, uh, and walkthrough kind of stuff to show, you know, see me playing through the game and, uh, most, uh, I'm trying to do like all side quests and that kind of stuff. Um. Eventually, I'll be doing some uh, video game reviews, uh, some newer ones, like Kind of Bridge of Spirits. Um, but then I'll also doing, not like retro games, but games that I've missed. Um, but also to be doing videos, not reviews, but also like um, doing, hopefully do some videos. Like um, uh, things I would like to see in sequels or things that I, I think that the games like slightly needed to improve upon or... You know, things the game's just missed and that kind of stuff. Uh, the the pros and cons about the video games. I think a good one would be like Jedi Fallen Order. Um, I think Respawn has a really good base in that. And I think they should... Uh, I think a sequel is definitely uh, a good idea. Whether or not it's in the plans. But I think uh, there's a good sequel. A good sequel could definitely come out of that. Um, but there's definitely things that could be approved upon it. So, um, but things, uh, that, uh, yeah, but put, like, ideas that I, ideas that I think, um, the game, you know, core structures in the game that I think worked well, things that didn't work well, uh, things that I think, um, that I would like to see in the, uh, in a new game and this possibly how those would work. Um, so I might do some reviews in a, in a video like that. I think Jedi Fallen Order might be my first try on that. So those hopefully will be coming in the future. So, uh, later today, uh, uh should be streaming again. So, alright. Uh, thanks for watching.